Hi guys, how are you doing? This is Weevil Next Century and this is my, well, rather my girlfriend's unboxing of the HTC Desire X, which is another mid-range Android smartphone from 2012. And this is her second attempt to get a decent smartphone for a good price. So first up was the Xperia Solar, which was pretty much a fail, as you probably saw in my review video. And so we hope that this time the HTC is a better choice. When we open the package, we of course see the HTC phone itself first, but then we'll take a look and see that we have some instructions manual beneath that with some license agreements and so on. And then next up we see that we have a small CD containing the full detail manual for the phone. So it's nice that they included this. And besides that, we see the USB cable right here. So she's not taking it out of the plastic due to the fact that she might have to return the phone if it isn't as good as she hopes. And we have to return it in mint condition. Next up, we see the headset. And this actually isn't a Beats headset, which is a shame because this phone features Beats audio. It's just one of those standard cheap headsets. Next up, we will see the power adapter, which is of course USB and then country specific plug on the other side. Here we see the phone itself and some of the features. It has a four inch screen, which is a super LCD screen with a 480 x 800 resolution. We also get Beats audio, a one gigahertz dual core processor and a five megapixel camera. If we take the plastic off, we see some more of the design of this phone and it's a very classic styled phone and it feels really nice in the hand because it has rounded corners and just feels overall also a lot better than the Xperia Solar. And then we also see on the back right here the Beats audio logo as well as the HTC logo and the 5 megapixel camera with LED flash, which is a really nice feature that they included. On the left side we see the micro USB port, on the right side the volume rocker and on top the on and off switch. And this also wraps it up. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please make sure to hit the subscribe button above for more future videos comparing this phone to the Xperia Solar and other smartphones. But the biggest thank you has to go out to my girlfriend for letting us join her journey to a decent mid-range Android smartphone. She's a great girl and even better girlfriend.